Well, hello. Somebody ordered Beatles this last week, and they said it'd be okay if I recorded and posted it. So we're gonna walk through getting that ready. So they had ordered a thousand Beatles and they requested to have it shipped into two packages of 500. So we've got two bags here. That way it just makes it easier for them to get it into their bins without having to count once they receive it. So just putting some newspaper in, using two smaller bags. They fit well in this uh, regional box A. Uh, good price for shipping on these boxes and they work well for these uh, smaller counts of beetles. So I'm gonna quickly turn around and get some water gel crystals. Throw them in there. That keeps them nice and hydrated. Gives them something to eat while they're on their travels to stay nice and hydrated. So I've got the beetles here in this bin. And we're gonna weigh them out into two different packages. I did send extra beetles, so the first package here is a little heavy. A little bit more than 500, probably about 600, maybe 650. Just adjusting that a little. On this first bag, you can see that runaway beetle in there. I eventually find him, get him back in the place he needs to go. So I used the funnel on this first bag. It's a little clumsy. This is the first order of the day, so I'm still getting, getting into a rhythm. We'll go ahead and pour those beetles in. Now these guys move pretty quickly compared to the uh, larva. Once they get in the bag, they'll climb up real fast. So we got to get that pinched off and then zip tied. Now these bags do have a drawstring on it, but those drawstrings don't get tight enough uh, in order for the insects to knock it out. So I do use the zip tie. We'll get the second bag, a little lighter on the second bag, but still about 550 in there. Now on the second bag, I decided to be a little bold. The bags are pretty sturdy at this size, so I just closed it real fast with that drawstring and then put the zip tie on. Like I mentioned, the, that drawstring just doesn't get closed tight enough. And these zip ties are real nice. They can be cut open uh, pretty easily with scissors or nail clippers uh, work really well actually that way you can reuse the bag if you need to so we'll get this closed up and here's a good little snippet i just could not get this tape gun to go again first order of the day wasn't in a rhythm yet got the, t the tape stuck on me just kind of frustrating from a process perspective uh, i was not efficient at all getting this thing taped up and closed but but got it done. Thank you for your order.